we we'll realize that people will change. But mm. if they get away with murder, they think that it's okay to do it. Mm. And then perhaps when someone is arrested, uh, then some he knows some big man somewhere, the person phones him to intervene and all that. Okay. I think we should actually encourage the police to enforce the law. Okay. And like he's saying, mm. I mean, I'm on some, uh, is it Gun West or Gun? Yeah. yeah, one of the. Yeah, Gun, Gun West. I yeah. think it's Gun West. Yeah. Uh, a municipal assembly can actually make a lot of money mm. just having their own local uh, enforcement uh, uh, officers to stand there okay. and actually slap some fines on the spot. That's it. And you know, total damage here to lose even two guns. <laughs> you know? <laughs> yeah, so it will, it, will be, it will be kind of yeah. a check. Yeah. All right, the last story I want to look at is a BNFT quickly. Um, economy worth 256 billion Ghana CD after <laughs> rebasing. Mm -hmm. Why are you laughing? Page three of this story <laughs> says that government to leverage future mineral revenue. Um, no, economy worth 26 billion. Now, this is a story by Obed Ata Yibwa. The country's economy per 2017 GDP estimates is now valued at 256.6 .6 billion Ghana cities, up from 205.9 billion Ghana cities recorded earlier after the Ghana Statistical Service um, completed its rebasing of the economy. The rebasing of the national account series by GSS means replacing the old base year 2006 used for compiling the constant price estimate to a new and more uh, recent base year 2013. The increase from 205.9 billion Ghana city to 256.6 .6 billion Ghana cities represents an expansion of 24.6%. Um, is however relatively lower when compared with the previous years from a new base year of 2013. Let me start with you, Honorable Dakwa. You know why I love? Why did you love? I love because mm. if our economy yeah. rebasing mm -hmm. 2018 yeah. is worth 51.2 billion. 56. No, 56. No, oh. no, no, no. Yeah. 51.2 billion dollars. Mm. Because 256 billion Ghana cities, if you divide that five, it's about 51.2 billion dollars. Okay. And we want to mortgage this country for 50 billion dollars for over 100 years. Mm. I mean, you imagine what we want to do to our future generations is not fair. So we need to think again. We are a big economy. We can do a lot by ourselves. Okay. You understand what I mean? Mm. So I think that this should inform us that our economy, far from being the economy that we think is not doing well, we have had serious policies that have been injected in this economy over the years okay. that is getting us gradually to stand on our feet. And I think we should begin to look at how we can build our own instead of constantly thinking of mortgaging our whole lives and our whole futures to other countries. And I think that I'm very proud to hear that our country for only 2018 is worth about 52 billion dollars. Okay. And I don't think that anybody hearing this will allow or think of mortgaging this country for $50 billion over 100 years. Thank okay. you. Richard? Yeah, rebasing, I think it's long overdue. Uh, conventionally, it's supposed to be done, I think, uh, every five years. Uh, this has been <coughs> nearly 12 years since mm. we last did uh, rebasing, uh, 2006, I think. So um, I think it's proper. Um, one other reason why you want to do that, so purely it's conventional that you do it every five years, and mm -hmm. the other reason is the structure of the economy has changed, and okay. uh, certain activities that you wouldn't have included uh, have now grown to a point where adding them uh, or paying attention to them makes sense. So that allows us to be able to see the real uh, expansion or growth of the economy. So I think uh, it's a good thing. Okay. Um, the the, the argument uh, my senior brother is making is, is, is one that I guess is, is encapsulated in Ghana Beyond Aid. The idea that we can do it and we will be able to do it. Uh, I think it's, it's a, a refreshing understanding that we must have. Okay. Um, you know, borrowing or mortgaging, as I said, that has not been confirmed or it's not being said we're going to do mm. it or not. Uh, it's a proposed. Uh, idea, but it hasn't been operationalized at any level. So uh, if we can do it, 
collecting all these uh, 120 <laughs> billion. <laughs> and uh, you, see the <laughs> you know, okay, so you know, yes, yes, so it, it's going to help us. You okay. know, I wanted to say something briefly yeah. earlier. Yeah, briefly. Well, well, when he said about the free SHS, yeah. mm -hmm. you know, free SHS really, I think MPP were not doing enough in making sure free SHS is the antidote to almost everything that we are talking about. Okay. Because truly, if you can lift up if you want to change the attitudes of your people, if you want this country to get to the point we want it to get education to beyond age, thing. education is critical. Okay. So uh, therefore, if we today, the educated, let's not sit on TV and you know bash free SHS, mm. because I know thousand and one people mm. whose children but for free SHS, we will not have access. I guess, I guess no, one is, no one is bashing it. Nobody. Oh, yes, yes, yes. I know people who are bashing no, no, it. They know okay. themselves. No. Let me go on. Let me. Somebody said, <laughs> God forbid, Richard, giving the chance. Richard, don't go there. No, 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 no please, don't please. go there. It's, it's, it's important. You see? All right, I need Somebody to think about said, viewers, God yes. forbid, if he get this chance, he will review. What yeah, does yeah, it mean? Yeah, but, but, what what but is no, mean no, by review? No, no, but, but, it's something but, that is under no, no, this country. Richard, Richard, good, you can't be good. Yeah. Do. No, no, yes. Richard, it has been done. Richard, yeah. You have 120 but billion left you, on review, the table review doesn't for mean, eight no. years. Review Richard, doesn't mean no, it's, it's being stopped, is it? You know, no, what does it mean? No, Tell no, us. No, what no, do you mean? Okay. Already, you couldn't already, do it. Let me bring my viewers. You couldn't do it. Somebody done it. You want to review. No, no, he was. What do you know about review? He was doing it progressively. No, 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 no. Answer that. Let me just answer that. You know what? There was a local man who I listen to, he, he's gone viral. The analysis this guy made, I think he's one of the best intellectuals that should be allowed to lecture at Ghana uh, Legon, uh, mm. Business, business mm. School. He actually made analysis that he thought that when the Nako Fado government came in, they would have done well to complete Jomama's 100 and or 250 oh, days. That sounds like you provide like 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 analysis. Let me let me give you my let me my viewers. But they abandoned that and they've crowded our children no, 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 into no, no, classrooms. No, no. Okay, where let they me don't even have. Let me bring my viewers. Air to breathe. <laughs> that All is right, totally this is from unacceptable. Bobby Big Boss from. Um, teacher, teacher Mante, he says illegal U-turns is also the cause for rampant road accidents yeah. across the country. Yeah. I'm pleading with the Parliamentary Committee on Road and Transport to take e to take legal actions with immediate effect. Thank you so much. And this one says that um, my g okay, all right, no, it's a press conference. No, um, this one says that um, from mistake from so on. Um, he wrote in three. I can't. I can't read <laughs> that. Okay. Um, let me just do two more. From Kwabla or Pokwasi Benghazi, not because of the special prosecutor and the person of. No, we're not looking at special prosecutor here. Um, let me just do two more. All right. Now we're watching live inside Dakroba KT Thread Shop. We praise Almighty God for protecting our president. Nana, Nana, no weapon formed against you shall prosper. Anyway, good morning to my manager. Um, my manager, okay. Then the last one, we just take the last one. It says that, um, blah 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 blah. Okay, okay, all right. I think I can, okay, all right. So, um, th thank you so much to Honorable Jakura, um, and for your time this morning. You've really helped the discussion. We wish you all the best in the, the day's work and all you have to do, sir. Thank you so much. And then also, Richard. Thank you very much. No, there's a lot left on untold, <laughs> but this 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 okay. here is very important. Free SHS. If ed the educated Richard, are arguing Richard, against you want to bring a education, discussion. you want to bring an I argument. Okay. All right. The, so the, I'm the ending the February the, segment. The, 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 the And I'm ending with my yeah, problem. Yeah. My problem says that what one puts aside is what one returns to find. Whoever dumps what I had of him or her will step on wet, wet earth. Once again, a Yoruba program. All right, so it ends the February review segment and the English segment of the Breakfast Show. Coming up next is the account segment, and you don't have you don't have to want to miss it. Be there.